Mr. Fax. Seagulls also go by gulls. Estimates put the number of species in this bird family between 50 and 60. The more seen as correct term for this bird is gull. It's reasonable because not all gulls or seagulls live exclusively near the sea. They like eating. As scavengers, their taste is diverse. Crab, ice cream, pigeon, plastic, plenty of things they eat. For some, it's even possible to swallow a whole rat, a squirrel or a rabbit. Size is diverse among gulls. The great black-backed gull is considered the largest of gulls, capable of reaching a wingspan of 1.7 meters and a length of about 80 centimeters. Their weight can reach 2.5 kilograms. The smallest of them, with a memorable name, is known as the little gull. This one usually has a wingspan of no more than 70 centimeters and a length of about 30 centimeters. Their weight can clock in at about 160 grams. There's a Bonaparte gull. A gull known as the Bonaparte gull got its name thanks to Charles Lucien Bonaparte. This man loved studying birds. He also happened to be the nephew of Napoleon Bonaparte. Gull beaks have a red spot. It has a crucial function. The younger chicks will peck at this red spot to signal they want food. The parents will then try to regurgitate it. There are dark colored ones. The lava gull, endemic to the Galapagos Islands, has adapted to this place where volcanic activity is present. There aren't many of this rare type of bird left, an estimated 3 to 600. Some whales despise these birds. Known for preying on live whales, kelp gulls can be mean. When a whale surfaces for a breath of air, kelp gulls pack out pieces of flesh. They tear off chunks of skin, leaving behind nasty wounds that can measure about a painful 20 centimeters long. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more facts and peace.